Hello gnomes, parents, and students. It's Mr. H here on the first Friday of the new school year. So I wanted to give you a quick update of some of the things that we've done this week and kind of catch you up on some of the things that have been going on here in social studies class. First thing is we've been collecting some personal geography data for gnomes students so we now know a little bit about where they've been coming from, Wake County, outside of Wake County, United States, outside of the United States. We've, we've got a chart of that information. We also have a chart of information of when people are coming to this part of the world. So we've taken all those charts and we've kind of put them up here on the map. So we've got them all up in all the different places around the United States and around the world where our gnome students are coming from. Today we started working on through building our graphs off of that information so students are starting to build these. If you're in my first block class your job is to finish this tonight if you're not finished with it. Many of them did finish it. The data will be on the GNOME site if you need the data. And, and then after we finished working on our data we started doing some skills pre-testing. I wanted to know what students could do and what they knew so that we could kind of gear where we're going to go with our first unit dealing with geography. So we started talking about compasses and maps and parts of a maps and things like that. So parents, ask your students tonight a little bit about how they did or how they think they did on the map skills pretest. I'll be grading that this weekend and handing it back to them on Monday so that you can kind of see what we know and what we don't know about geography. So we've been working with personal geography. We've been working on a little bit of pretesting. Next week we're going to do some more practicing with maps, reading a map understanding where things are. We need to know where the continents are. We need to know where the oceans are so that we can start talking about the history of these places. So that's what we've been working on here at the social studies class. Hopefully everything's gone well. If you have any questions, make sure you let me know.